It is truly a great pleasure to welcome the newest graduates of the Physical Sciences Division of the University of Chicago and their family and friends. Graduates, take pride in your accomplishments. You have all done something remarkable. Your family, your friends, and your professors are most proud of you. The eighth president of the university, Edward Levy, said at the university's 310th convocation in 1965, through this institution, you are not only joined to each other and to us, but to graduates of long ago and hopefully of many years to come. No one owns this institution. It possesses all of us. It calls upon us to enter into its fellowship of the intellect. In this fellowship, no place is more honored than that of the graduate who carries this university in his mind and heart. I welcome you to that place. In that place, you are part of a distinguished cadre of fellow alumni who have changed the world. I have no doubt that in time, you also will change the world. I have no doubt that each of you will use to best advantage what you have learned, that you can make a difference in the challenging world you inherit, both inside and outside the academy, and your lives will reflect honor back to your families, your communities, and to the University of Chicago. Congratulations. The tremendous accomplishments of our graduates would be impossible without the dedication and passion of the professors who facilitate their education. In recognition of this, the University of Chicago each year honors four faculty members who have demonstrated exemplary teaching and mentoring throughout their careers. Nominees are chosen by graduate students, and the bulk of the testimonials that they provide are their nomination materials. The winners are selected by a committee of previous award recipients and other distinguished faculty members. This year's faculty award for excellence in graduate teaching and mentoring from the Division of the Physical Sciences will be presented by Edward Blucher, professor and chair in the Department of Physics. Dean Cobb, I have the honor to present Heinrich Martin Yeager for the faculty award for excellence in graduate teaching and mentoring. Heinrich Jaeger is a dedicated teacher and mentor whose students thrive in an atmosphere that values creativity and independence. By taking abstract theoretical concepts and applying them to create novel approaches for interacting with the physical world, he opens up new fields of research. He employs creative experimental techniques to dissect the workings of some of the most astonishing phenomena in macroscopic complex fluids and at the surprising and delicate mechanics and structures at the nanoscale. His emphasis on design, based on disorder, uh, instead of regularity, is a model for pattern formation that has profound applications for structure formation. He inspires students and colleagues across the university through his infectious enthusiasm for establishing a dialogue between the sciences and the arts, and through his ability to reach out to demonstrate science to the general public. By promoting an atmosphere of creativity and independence, Heinrich Jaeger successfully encourages students to attack a wide range of problems that cross the boundaries separating di different disciplines of science. In 2013, Art Kelly established the Arthur L. Kelly Faculty Prize for Exceptional Service in the Physical Sciences Division. Mr. Kelly received his MBA from the university in 1964. In addition to his contributions to finance, business, international relations, and geography, 
Mr. Kelly served as a trustee of the university from 1988 to 2008 and has served for nearly two decades as a member of the visiting committee to the Physical Sciences Division, including 10 years as chairman. We are pleased to honor his contributions to the Physical Sciences Division and the University of Chicago through this award. The Kelly Prize celebrates faculty who, outside of their classroom teaching and research, have made exceptional efforts in promoting and supporting the Physical Sciences Division. I am pleased to announce that the 2016 recipient of the Arthur L. Kelly Prize for Exceptional Faculty Service in the Physical Sciences Division is Michael Foote. Michael Foote, professor in the Department of Geophysical Sciences, served as chair of the department for a total of nine years, beginning in July of 2006. During that time, the department hired several new promising young faculty. Before that, Michael served as master of the Physical Sciences Collegiate Division and associate dean of the division. Throughout his years on the faculty, Michael has also given of himself by serving on several committees including most recently chairing the Faculty Committee for Periodic Review of the Physical Sciences Collegiate Division uh, and serving on the College Disciplinary Committee. Michael has a distinguished record as a paleontologist. He is a fellow of the Paleontological Society and was the recipient of the Society's Shoe Shirt Award several years ago. Congratulations, Michael. At the university-wide ceremony this morning, I presented our candidates with the degree of Master of Science to the president of the university. In presence of the faculty of the university and members of the board of trustees, he formally conferred those degrees in recognition of the incredible academic achievements of our students. At this time, it is my honor to award individual diplomas to each of our graduates. As Dean of Students for the Physical Sciences Division, I now have the honor to present for their diploma these students who have successfully completed a program of advanced study in the physical sciences, culminating in the degree Master of Science. In the master's program in computer science, Shuaib Vikar Ahmed. <laughs> Betty Chimay Chen. Patricia Ann Corvino. Bryce Stephen Cunningham. Iman Mohammed Dai. Mauricio Dominguez Armenta. Jason Brian Edelstein. Scott Michael Fennelly. <laughs> Timothy Hasbert. <laughs> Zhenhui Wang. John Alexander Johnson. Omar Sami Latif. Nengbao Liu. <laughs> David Joseph Manglano. <laughs> Venkata Krishna Sumanth Manam. <laughs> Nicholas Pan. <laughs> Catherine Alexis Perry. Matthew Phillip. Blake Shapiro. Michael Sylvester. Brian Lingshen Wallace. 
John Thomas Marziani Robel. Shigan Zhu. In the master's program in financial mathematics, Joshua Hunter. Yi Wei Liu. Elyar Mangutov. Da Si. Durga Smitha Srikakolapu. In the master's program in the physical sciences division, Marie Bergelin. Hong Yu Sha. In the Department of Statistics, Liu Kao. Cheng Cheng. Xiao Mao Cheng. Li Zhun Ding. Justin Xu. Jiang Jiang. Bo Yuan Lie. Young Suk Si Li. Kun Lu. Sean Fiona Walker. Yi Shen Yi. Yi Zhang. At the university-wide ceremony this morning, I presented our candidates for the degree of Doctor of Philosophy to the president of the university. In the presence of the faculty of the university and members of the board of trustees, he formally conferred those degrees 
in recognition of the incredible academic achievement of our students. Today, those scholars who are being admitted to the community of doctors of philosophy will receive both a hood and their diploma for their disciplinary achievements. The components of academic regalia derived from medieval clerical dress are the gown, the cap, and for those attaining the highest competencies, the hood. The velvet edge of the hood is dark blue, indicating the significant achievement of the level of doctor of philosophy. The lining is maroon, the school color of the University of Chicago. In our ceremony, the hood will be placed over the head of the candidates by the dissertation advisor or department chair or faculty representative. As Dean of Students for the Physical Sciences Division, I now have the honor to present for their diploma in hood these students who have attained scholarly distinction and have prepared a dissertation that contributes to knowledge in a particular field of research in the physical sciences, culminating in the degree Doctor of Philosophy. Michael Adam Bowles, hooded by Heinrich Jaeger. <laughs> Dissertation, self-assembly of collodial nanocrystals. Surface ligands promote the formation of, unex of unexpected super lattices. Committee members, Dimitri Talapin, Heinrich Jaeger, and Philippe Guillot Sione. <laughs> James Michael Henderson, hooded by Kai Lee. Dissertation Antimicrobial Peptides, Selectivity and Line Activity governed by membrane properties. Committee members, Kai Lee, Steven Seibner, and Boji Tian. <laughs> Sangyun Lee, hooded by Kai Lee. Dissertation, multi-scale modeling of ion exchange mechanism in the CIC anti-porter. Committee members, Gregory Voth, Aaron Dinner, and Suri Van Kuntanathan. <laughs> Ray Bin Liang, hooded by Kai Lee. Dissertation, multi-scale reactive molecular dynamics simulation of proton transport in proteins. Committee members, Gregory Voth, Kai Lee, and Suri Vaikuntanathan. <laughs> Lan Wu, hooded by Kai Lee. Dissertation, metal catalyzed asymmetric epoxidation and its related reactions. Committee members, Hisashi Yamamoto, Varesh Rawal, and Sergey Kozman. Anthony Michael Martinez, hooded by Kai Lee. Dissertation, chemical probes for controlling bacterial transcription, inducing mitochondrial per permeabilization, and studying cellular oxidation state. Committee members, Sergey Kozman, Joseph Picciarilli, Boji Tian, and Paul Schumacher. Leafka Koop, hooded by Andrew Davis. Dissertation, the isotopic evolution of the early solar system as traced by Hibonite-rich refractory inclusions. Committee members, Andrew Davis, Philip Heck, Fred Chesla, Frank Richter, and Michael Pellin. Usiluta Anund Baput, hooded by Carlos Keenig. Dissertation, some results on perverse sheaves and Bernstein-Sato polynomials. 
Committee members, Victor Ginsburg and Alexander Balinson. <laughs> Xu Yang Cheng, hooded by Carlos Keenig. Dissertation, towards a non-standard Fourier analysis in automorphic forms. Some results on two toy examples. Committee members, Paul Herman, Bao Nyo, and Matthew Emerton. <laughs> Max David Engelstein, hooded by Carlos Keenig. Dissertation, free boundary problems for harmonic and caloric measure. Committee members, Carlos Keenig and Wilhelm Schlag. <laughs> Simeon Philip, hooded by Carlos Keenig. Dissertation, Teichmuller Dynamics and Hodge Theory. Committee members, Alexander Eskin and Madhav Nori. <laughs> Andrew Leong Li Gung, hooded by Dennis Hirschfeld. Dissertation, the classification of five-dimensional geometries. Committee members, Benson Farb, and Danny Caligari. <laughs> Waivehi Madhav Thati, hooded by Kazia Kato. Dissertation, ramification theory for arbitrary valuation rings in positive characteristic. Committee members, Kazia Kato and Alexander Balinson. Jing Yuan Chen, hooded by Heinrich Jaeger. Dissertation, Barry Phase Physics in Free and Interacting Fermionic Systems. Committee members, Dom Son, William Irvine, Michael Levin, and Leon Tao Wang. <laughs> Li Chung Ha, hooded by Cheng Chin. Dissertation, Bose-Einstein condensates in a shaken optical lattice. Committee members, Cheng Chin, Jonathan Simon, Zheng Tian Lu, Yao Hua, and Catherine Levin. <laughs> Zhe Liu, hooded by John Lafferty. Dissertation, high dimensional graph estimation, estimation and density estimation. Committee members, John Lafferty, Matthew Stevens, and Rena Barber. <laughs> Andrew Naiman Popik, hooded by John Lafferty. Dissertation, statistical methods for climactic processes with temporal non-stationarity. Committee members, Michael Stein, Mihai Anitescu, and Matthew Stevens. Dean Cobb, I now have the honor to present for their hood these students who have attained scholarly distinction and prepared a dissertation that contributes to knowledge in a particular field of research in the physical sciences and were awarded the degree Doctor of Philosophy at a convocation ceremony earlier this year. Noman, <laughs> Noman Ahmed Shamsi, hooded by Kai Lee. Dissertation, small molecule inhibitors of glycolysis and protein synthesis. Committee members, Sergey Kozman, Stephen Crone, and Joseph Picciarilli. <laughs> Rebecca Ann Fisher, hooded by Andrew Campbell. Dissertation, earth secretion, core formation, and core composition. Committee members, Andrew Campbell, Fred Chesla, Dion Hines, Frank Richter, and Nicholas Dufa. <laughs> Lee Patrick McCuller, hooded by Stephen Meyer. Dissertation, testing a model of Planck scale quantum geometry with broadband correlation 
of co-located 40-meter interferometers. Committee members, Stephen Meyer, Craig Hogan, Aaron Chow, Daniel Holtz, and Chang Chin. So far today, the celebration has been focused on you, the graduates of the Physical Sciences Division. We all recognize that our achievements are dependent upon the prior contributions of others. As Sir Isaac Newton penned almost 300 years ago, if I have seen further, it is by standing on the shoulders of giants. But I also suspect that none of you would be here today without the love encouragement or the support of many others. There have been many, many inspirations in your life. Parents, guardians, family members, ministers, scout leaders, elementary school teachers, mentors, spouses, partners, friends, or even children. To thank those who have supported you, whether they are here or not, I invite all graduates to rise and turn toward the audience and give them a round of applause. And now please turn back toward the front and I ask you to thank the faculty and staff of this great university for all they have done to make you the accomplished person you are today. Please be seated. As you lead this, our 527th convocation some of you will continue your formal education here at the University of Chicago or elsewhere. Others will start new careers inside or outside of the academy. As you embark on the next phase of your life's journey, I would like to share an insight from a colleague of mine in the field of astrophysics, Neil deGrasse Tyson, who responded to a question about motivation with the following. The problem, often not discovered until late in life, is that when you look for things like love, meaning, motivation, it implies that, it, that they are sitting behind a tree or under a rock. The most successful people in life recognize that in life they create their own love. They manufacture their own meaning. They generate their own motivation. For me, I am driven by two main philosophies. Know more today about the world than I knew yesterday, and lessen the suffering of others. You'd be surprised how far that gets you. We, your teachers and mentors, trust that you will pursue your goals and aspirations with ambition tempered by wisdom, with discernment sharpened by critical reasoning, and with dedication fortified by ideals. Good luck and thank you. This now concludes the Physical Sciences Diploma and Hooding Ceremony at the 527th Convocation of the University of Chicago. I thank you for witnessing today's ceremony and welcome you to stay for the reception. Also note that the photographer will be available in the main foyer if you would like to pose for additional photos. Graduates, congratulations. Please rise for the recession. Uh -huh.